Okay, we poured two and a half gallons of uh, geothermal green clean into the bucket. All you do is just take it and plug it in. And the pump kicks on. So what we're going to do is open the bypass valve, open up both of these valves, and start pumping. And now what we did is we opened up the valves on the flow controllers, both of the boiler drains, we opened them. Now you don't need to run this back through very, very fast, as you can see that it is actually going in pretty slow, and that's exactly what we want to do. Right now, it's going to be flushing through the system and through the coil. And as soon as it starts coming back through, because you don't need to drain the entire system there, you can use what's inside there. And uh, what will happen is this will start foaming, as you can see, the geothermal cleaner is starting to come back through there now. It's starting to burn and burn right now. And then you'll start foaming inside the bucket here. What I want to show you is, look how fast this cleaner cleans. This is the actual system right here. This is what I want to show you, how fast and easy this biodegradable cleaner cleans. There's no magic here. You've seen how plugged up it was. And look at it cleaning the system right now, right before your very eyes. see it dissolving before your eyes. That flow control valve in there could not move. That's how plugged up the system was. And again, this stuff is biodegradable. And it will not harm you. I'll show you. We can put our hands right in it. Right there, no harm, nothing. It's all biodegradable. Again, as you can see, that it's cleaning the system right there, right there. Before your eyes, it's disappearing. Another angle like this. That's the iron that gets built up in these open loop geothermal systems. And this is the way this one's hooked up, this is not a correct application the way these things are hooked up. They see particles flowing through there. See the particles coming loose? There you go, now you can see them. The piece is going through real slow. As you can see, the bottom there, it's almost all gone. And you can see the particles, just chunks flying through there. But it will literally, when it breaks off, it will literally dissolve it, like putting sugar in coffee. It will dissolve the iron. Again, this is only about after 30 minutes of cleaning.
right there is about an hour of just filtering geothermal green clean through the geothermal system. You see there's still some residue at the top, but it will clean this thing like brand new. Geothermal green clean running, cleaning the geothermal system. This is after two hours of cleaning with geothermal green clean. How crystal clear it was from the beginning to the end. You can actually see all the way through it now. crystal clear it is. And the flow regulator works. Goes up, goes down. Nice and smooth action. Before it wouldn't go up because there was calcium actually built up on that line right there. So that thing wouldn't even move at all before. So it was actually closing, pinching off down there, plus all the iron. So now as you can see that it does flow nice and freely all the way up and down. But again, this is not the proper way to install an open-loop geothermal system. That's after two hours of cleaning. How crystal clear it is now. Geothermal green clean.